Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Study Junction and today I am going to tell you about the most important questions from chapter number 1 for class 8 mathematics. The chapter is rational numbers. So let's get started. So these are the contents and we are going to start with chapter 1 rational numbers. So if you come here on page number 9 this example number one is very important these kind of questions come and then uh, you can also solve this question then here you can see additive inverse so additive inverse questions are very important these come in path so here's another try these so you can uh, do these also this uh, one is also very important minus of uh, minus x then again this question then come on the exercise part so you need to practice a plenty of these kind of questions use uh, using properties questions then i already said additive inverse is very important then uh, these are also important multiplicative inverse additive inverse and these so question two th uh, third and fourth these come in one mark or two marks or with a combined question so name the property so i think it's uh, not very important so these kind of questions multiplying by the reciprocal or like additive inverse so these kind of questions generally come in the exam then uh, uh, the, these are very simple so representation of rational numbers on the number line it's very very important question and it's a must do question so as you can see here in example 6 and example 7 i think these are the very um, common kind of questions asked in the exam so these are asked in uh, various exams so these need to be practiced a lot so the last exercise of this book so it's very simple exercise it's to represent the numbers uh, these numbers on the number line so you can uh, do it easily then again number line third question is write five uh, rational numbers with a smaller than two so you, these can be written the main basic thing you need to do in the uh, this exercise is practice a lot of these kind of questions so this was it from ncrt but uh, if i summarize the type of questions you need to do these uh, they are not problem sums in these so you need to do problem sums i think in rd sharma there are so i'll also make uh, videos for important questions from rd sharma after i covered the all the chapters from uh, ncrt so from this exercise uh, these uh, questions which uh, tell us to find the rational numbers between these and also one thing uh, i was asked in my exam which i remember still was a question in which how many note this question how many rational numbers are present between 1 and 2 so it's a very important question i was asked also in my exam and also in my test so the answer for this question is infinite there are infinite and less rational numbers present between 1 and 2 also you can uh, be asked in between 3 and 4 1 and 4 and anything like this so the answer will remain same infinite so this was another important question which is not present in this ncrt book but it's really important so don't forget to do the exercise uh, uh, examples so examples also play an important role when you will be in 9th and 10th grade, you will observe that most of the questions the board puts in the exams are uh, examples. So, you can uh, try to sense how the examples play an important role. So, just, uh, yeah, one thing important is just read the properties, like whether associative properties um, open in, uh, in like, uh, is open for division and multiplication these kind of verification sums come yeah uh, one thing verify sums verification sums are very common i think if you get assignments from your school you would observe that most of the questions are from verification so 
verification questions are very important um problem sums you need to practice but the principle in these problem sums will remain same you just need to know how to divide multiply add where to use subtraction where to use division where to use multiplication so once uh, just uh, revise the properties as, as these are important for verification type of questions so this was it for uh, this video i told you about how the questions are asked and uh, which are the questions important from this book so hope you like this video don't forget to like to my video subscribe to my channel and also share it with your friends if you find it helpful so hope you enjoy studying math thank you